Hi, my name is Peter Schmidt, and I'm using this YouTube channel to post some of my Elvis footage collection, which is very hard to come by, it's very hard to find, it's very expensive, and uh, to have digital transfers made is very expensive as well, and all the work uh, to dub and correct it. So all in all, it's a big investment in financial terms and also in work. So. But it's not about that. Um, posting this for David's YouTube channel, Elvis is the man. So please check this out uh, for the channel and also for the video. Um, I'm going to leave it on uh, YouTube listed for a little while. Then I'm unlist this uh, so uh, David gets good traction on his video. So if you do like Elvis, uh, it's one of the best maybe the best Elvis channel, because uh, David provides always some context, historical and uh, insider knowledge. So please check out his channel, leave a like, subscribe to it. And until then, we'll see you and here's the footage. Okay, bye. What's up guys, welcome to this video on Elvis is the man. Thanks Peter for that endorsement, I really appreciate it, it's very kind. So today's video, I wanna highlight one of Elvis's most dramatic performances that he gave in the 70s. He performed this ever since January 72, all the way right up to the end, 1977. You know, Lord, I've been in a prison. He initially started performing this song in Vegas, January 1972. I want to start off by showing you guys this version. Not all of you have heard it, but it is very, very unique. A song by Frankie Lane. Now this time you gave me a mouth. the desert You know, Lord, I've been in a prison That version there is different because that was the first time he ever performed it live and you could tell from that recording like there's a lot of echo in it for some reason which I think makes it unique also it's a lot slower you know because a lot of times Elvis would start off slow but he like speed it up a little later on Elvis performed this song in uh, the Elvis on Tour documentary. He performed it for Aloha. He didn't do it for Madison Square Garden, but he performed this pretty much consistently all the way through uh, up to like 1973. One of his most passionate performances, the thing about Elvis I think that makes him unique is that he doesn't just sing words, he puts so much feeling into it, like he lived it and really he did by this point. This song really meant a lot to Elvis in 1972. But I think by 1973, he had it perfected. She took my reason for living. She took my small baby boy. Oh, my That performance there was from Uniondale, New York, Nassau Coliseum. Elvis did two shows that day. As you can see, some fantastic footage of these shows exist. 
At that performance we just saw, the afternoon performance, Elvis was wearing the snowflake outfit. 16,000 people packed the Coliseum that afternoon. This was just two months after Aloha from Hawaii was broadcast in the United States. You can just see Elvis's enthusiasm and his joy for performing in that footage. I was recently watching a video of Peter being interviewed. He says that about 80% of Elvis's concerts have been documented by private fan footage. That's amazing. No, I don't know how good all the quality would be. You know, maybe some is from farther back, some is up close like you can see here in these clips. But that was amazing to think about. I heard that a lot of fan footage was actually confiscated by Elvis's bodyguards. Colonel says, if you find anybody, get rid of them. You can tell Elvis is having a great time. We are so lucky to have this footage. I'm so glad this was not confiscated by one of the Memphis Mafia. Elvis was in great voice and he looked so good. Don't forget, four months earlier, Muhammad Ali saw Elvis in Vegas and he says, you're almost prettier than me. I noticed that photograph being taken. One thing I want you guys to hear that I really like from the ending of this song is how he changed up the end. You can really hear this clearly, December 3rd show, 1973. Check this one out. Yes, Peter, thanks a lot for this footage, me and the Elvis fans. Thank you very much. If you like this, hit the like button. It helps you grow and expand the channel. Comment down below. Let me hear your thoughts. Subscribe if you haven't already, and we'll talk to you next time.